For today, I just wanted to just thank you guys so much for your amazing support. So much has happened this past year of 2018. I got a lot more animals, I moved to a new home, and I started my whole YouTube channel during this year too. So, so many amazing things have happened and I didn't expect any of it to happen whatsoever. It's really funny because I literally just started my YouTube channel last September and it was just to make a little bit of like just a few care videos wasn't really planning to be a YouTuber or anything. And then when I moved here in April is when I kind of really started with my channel. And I can't believe that I found such an amazing community to spread my knowledge and to just share my love for these animals with other people that have the same passion. It's so hard to find people that actually love reptiles as much as I do. So it's so amazing that I have found my own community through doing YouTube. And I just appreciate all of you guys so much. 2018 has also been an amazing year because I was finally able to start breeding and I have crested gecko babies and I'm just so excited. It's been so much fun. I also met two of my best friends, Caitlin and Michelle, and we started making videos together too. And I just, I feel so blessed and I just can't thank you guys enough for allowing me to be able to do all of this and just supporting me and I can't wait for the next things to come in 2019. So for my New Year's resolutions for 2019, something I'm really hoping to do is actually to start breeding gargoyle geckos. I'm still waiting on eggs from Sunny. She's been very stubborn about it, but I'm really hoping I'll get some gargoyle eggs. Also some Dalmatian crested geckos. That's definitely one of my New Year's resolutions for 2019. I also want Chancho to get huge and Vendetta. So I'm really hoping that my baby animals are just gonna get so much bigger in 2019. It's so much fun watching the process. And it's hard for me to tell because I'm with them every single day. So I can't really see the progress unless I look at old pictures. So I can't wait to do that at the end of 2019 and see how much they've all grown. For 2019, I want to go to a lot more reptile shows and hopefully be able to travel around a little bit more than I've been able to in the past. I also just want to educate way more in 2019, open more minds, get more people interested in reptiles. So I'm just all about that. That is like my number one mission. So I can't wait to change more minds in 2019 and hopefully we can all learn new things in 2019 and better the lives of our animals in captivity. So I'm just looking forward to new reptilian adventures and meeting some of you guys this year. And again, I can't thank you enough for all of your support. I'm going to leave some videos that are just some of my favorite moments from 2018 and little clips of all of my animals. So again, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy the video and have a wonderful day and happy new year. All right, go. It's like an open. <laughs> I'm scared, Trisha. I don't know. Just how to don't do grab it. its head. 
Just go near the back and just pick him up. Oh my you, god. You can do it. He's all scary. What is it like? Uh, I don't know. Look at her very fat tail. Wow. Looks like a leaf. Oh yeah? Tokays are haters. Are. <laughs> it's like, what's the point? You might as well get a pet rock. But even a pet <laughs> rock you can look at. <laughs> Overpriced turds. <babe. laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just be honest here. For my liking, I prefer my reptiles to not look like idiots. So. <laughs> <laughs> Basics, they look like a lychee that's been put in the microwave for too long. Oh like, my god. Caitlin's <laughs> attached to a tree right now. <laughs> so. Just licking everything. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. There he goes. Hey. You did it. What's his first step he's ever done in his life? <laughs> he's never been on stairs. Like the real thing.